handicapper Steve here handicapping the racing from Turfway Park here on Thursday. It is the 1st of December 2022. I'm going to look at the sixth race from Turfway, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5 for more selections for race courses around the world. The sixth race from Turfway, it's an allowance race per $76,000. Races for Phillies Mayors, three year olds and upwards. Um, great, great price here, claim, claim price, uh, or a purse here 13 horses enter keep in mind only 12 could go to the tapita the distance of ground of 1300 meters if you want to go by that or the distance of ground of six and a half furlongs on the all-weather main track 1300 meters six and a half furlongs my top selection here, I'm going to go with the number seven horse. The number seven horse promises to dance 73411 for me in the Superfecta. 73411 Super. Top selection seven horse promises to dance. Dance. Three year old filled by Broken Vow. Brad Cox trains. Chris Landeros gets to mount. The horse's most recent appearance came 13th of October at Keeneland. Six furlongs on option 125 claimer. And he finished third by five lengths that day. And was a little bit wide, a little bit bumpiness in the lane, and just couldn't keep up. I thought she saw a tough group of horses. Refreshing back to Turfway with the source ran very well last season. I'm going to give her a shot to win. Two back on the off the bench on the 25th of September at uh, Churchill. Six rungs off to Lady. She finished fourth by five lengths that day. And she sat back, or she sat with the pace setters early on, but then she just couldn't keep up. Definitely flat. Definitely need the race there. And then the Serena song here at Turfway. Six furlongs, 26 to March. Finishing fifth by 23 lengths that day. She must have bled without the Lasix. She just never was really comfortable there. And then first start with the Lasix at Chur uh, Turfway. 10th of February. Six and a half off to 50. Guess what? She's a course and distance winner. Winning by two lengths on the front and all throughout. She basically won quite, quite easily. It was a very slow six and a half, shall I say, also. 118 and four. Uh, and then before then, the gavel at Turfway going six. She finished second by two and three quarter lengths. She just stalked and just couldn't keep up. But training well locally for the last few weeks, I'm going to give her a shot here at 9-2. Um, I, I think the three-horse laugh and play is your second likeliest winner. Uh, most recently going 5.5 at Keeneland on the turf. I thought the place wasn't bad at all. Um... And then before that, the, the victory on the Kentucky Downs turf course, I thought that victory was very nicely um, on the front end. Uh, coming here at 9-2, and definitely using your late pick four. But to recap my selection for the six from Turfway, let's take the seven horse. Promises to dance. Give kudos to the three horse laugh and play. 7-3-4-11 super. 7-3 in your multi-race. So good luck to all. Please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5. Good luck, everybody.